Hey guys, it's Warren here and today we are making fudge. Now what's great about this is it only has four ingredients plus it's really easy to prepare and it's a great gift to give at Christmas as well. So let's get baking. And this is enough to make 25 portions of fudge. To begin with, in a saucepan add 100 grams of butter, one tin of condensed milk which is around 400 grams and 400 grams of soft light brown sugar. Now add one tablespoon of golden syrup, then stir everything together over a low heat until the sugar's dissolved and the butter's melted. Bring the mixture up to a gentle simmer, then you'll need to stir continuously, remaining over a low heat for 15 minutes. And after the cooking time, we need to check the fudge is ready. So take a jug of cold water, then teaspoon out a small amount of the fudge. Drop it into the cold water, then spoon it out with your fingers. And if you're able to form a ball with the fudge when you rub it between your fingers, then you know it's ready. Otherwise, leave it to cook for a small while longer on the stove. And next, we need to briefly beat the fudge mixture. So pour it into a large mixing bowl, then using either a wooden spoon, electric hand whisk or a food mixer, beat for between three and five minutes until the fudge has just started to set. Then when you're happy it's done, stop beating and take an oven dish that's lined with some greaseproof or parchment paper on the bottom. And now simply pour the fudge into the dish. Spread it out so it's nice and even and flat, but remember to work quickly because the longer you leave it, the colder it will get and the harder it will be to spread. When you're happy with the finish of your fudge, simply stick it in the fridge and leave it to set for at least one hour. And this would allow it to firm up nicely when cutting. And when you do take your fudge from the fridge, run a knife down it and cut it into 25 equal square pieces. And this can be cut and stored in the fridge until it's ready to be eaten and that is how easy it is to make your very own homemade fudge with just four ingredients. Now if you loved the look of this recipe, remember to give this video a thumbs up and remember also to hit the subscribe button and the bell button and that will notify you when I upload new videos.